time. Good day, judges. Uh, my name is John. I'm a home brewer and also the founder of Arcana Coffee PH. So um, it's an honor to be here and I'm very excited to show you my coffees. So give me a few minutes while I set up my espresso and for my signature beverage. Thank you. So for today, I'll be using uh, 17 grams of coffee with a total yield of 34 and we'll be extracting the coffee 20 to 25 seconds. So for this coffee, expect this espresso to we have to have a medium acidity, medium to high sweetness, medium bitterness, and for the tactile, it has a very silky body. So for the aroma, try to look for that dark chocolates. And for uh, the flavor notes, it has a reminiscent of grapefruits and caramel. So before drinking your espresso, give it a little agitation and enjoy your espresso while I prepare for your milk beverage. Enjoy. For my milk beverage, I'll be using the same dose, which is 17 grams in, 34 out with 25 to 30 seconds. And for the milk that I'll be using, I'll be using a, double, a single freeze distillation process, wherein why we use this process is for us to enhance the creaminess and the sweetness of this drink. So this is a combination of 80% full cream milk and 20% oat milk. Okay. For this coffee, expect this coffee to have medium acidity, medium to high sweetness. For the tactile, it also has a silky body and a quite low bitterness. So try to look for that butter cookies flavor notes. At the same time, for the aroma, try to look for that milk chocolate. Enjoy judges while I prepare your pour over. So for the pour over, um, I'll be using uh, a Kalita dripper. So my ratio is a one is one is to twelve point five, with uh, parameters of twenty four uh, clicks on the Commandante grinder, with a temperature of eighty seven degrees Celsius, and with a total brewing time of two minutes and thirty seconds. So this is going to be a total of four pours. So my first pour would be fifty grams of loom. After 30 seconds, I'll be pouring my second pour, which is 110, to extract the sweetness of this coffee. By the time I reach 1 minute and 30 seconds, I'll be pouring up until 180 to get that body of this coffee. And for my last pour, I'm going up straight to 250 ml of water to get that um, balance, okay? 30 seconds for my next pour, up until 110. Next pour up to 180. And last pour, 250 ml. So for this, you might notice, we'll be using a different cup. This cup, you might see a hint of pink. So this is uh, for us to add that hint of sweetness. This is actually a psychological thing that we're in every time we drink into something pink, it adds sweetness every time we drink something. So we'll be using this cup and my total brewing time is 2 minutes and 30 seconds. So can you wait to taste? For this coffee, expect this coffee to have a very mild acidity, a medium sweetness, medium uh, bitterness, and a medium body. And expect that flavors of grapefruits, a little bit of nuts, and caramel. And for the aroma, tropical fruits are there. So kindly enjoy your drink while I prepare my last uh, signature beverage for you. Enjoy. Okay, for my signature beverage, I'll be using, uh, I'll be up dosing my espresso. So I'll be using 18 grams of coffee into 40 out with a 28 seconds extraction. So for this reference with my signature beverage, um, this is inspired by one of my favorite Filipino meriendas. I'm pretty sure you are familiar with this one. It's Turon. So this is actually, uh, uh, one of my favorite um, meriendas of all time. So let me show you how I incorporate it to coffee. All right. So for this recipe, I'll be using a total of 120 ml 
of espresso. And also, I'll be adding a homemade 60 ml banana sauce. So this is actually done by banana, sugar, and water. Next, 40 ml of homemade caramel sauce. And of course, 60 ml of clarified milk. This is, consists of the same milk that I've used before. So for this drink, expect a flavors of banana, of course. That homemade turon that uh, you buy every afternoon. And of course, medium to high sweetness, caramel flavors. And to top it off, and to top it off, it has a very clean finish. So please. And thank you so much for this opportunity to share my specialty coffee for you judges. And happy anniversary, Kappa. Time. First runner up goes to Freddy. Let's go! Picture for picture. Our 2024 Kappa Coffee Champion. Thank you, judges. <laughs>